hope I'm pronouncing that wrong. Castañé, Castañel, Castañer. Castañer. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I apologize, I know this background isn't the very prettiest, but I told you guys throughout all of my vlogs that my house is currently under construction, especially this room, so I don't have any furniture in here except for my desk and my chair. I have stuff everywhere, but I figured it was finally time for me to do a try on haul of shoes. Now, you guys know I own lots of shoes. I love shoes. I love shoes about as much as I love denim. I, Oliver's literally just sitting there. I love shoes. And all of the shoes that I purchased are actually from completely new places, shoes that I've never bought. I have a pair of six total, and these weren't all purchased like at the same time. They were all kind of scattered throughout. So what I'm going to do is I've been waiting for my mirror to come in, and I think I showed you guys that my cats knocked over my huge full-size mirror, and so I didn't have a mirror this entire time. Trying to get ready without a mirror, I don't know how anyone does it, without like a full-size mirror to see your entire outfit, I felt crazy. Like I felt like I couldn't understand what looked good together like I needed a visual I needed to be able to see it so I am so happy my mirror literally got in here like 30 minutes ago the box is still literally laying on the floor because I was like no I need to do this video so yeah so I'm going to show you all of the shoes I will leave everything linked down below if I can find them I know most of them I'll be able to find maybe one or two of them I they might be sold out I'm not sure but anything that I can link for you guys I will very quickly because I always get asked questions like this my nails are opi's funny bunny gel polish all of my jewelry literally pretty much everything is brendolin and cora i got this really thick chain my dad passed it over to me it was his so i've just had it on every one of my rings is brendolin and cora and you're not really going to be able to see all of them anyway but people always ask my shirt is a Brennan & Core logo tee, which by the time you guys see this, these will be available. And then for my necklaces, I am wearing the My Stars and My Moons necklace, which was on Brennan & Cora, but it is sold out. And then this eye necklace that is from a brand called Adorn Mondi, which I will leave the link down below as well. If you guys see me sipping my coffee, I have to pack because I am leaving to Tulum in a couple of hours, basically. I, leave at, I have to leave my house at 4 in the morning. So I poured myself some coffee because I have a lot to do and if you guys saw the mess in this room, you would make fun of me. I will start off basically with the first pair of shoes that I bought and I have been kind of obsessed with this girl on YouTube that I've mentioned before. I um, bought a couple of jewelry pieces, actually the earrings that I'm wearing right now are from her line and she is a YouTuber called Tony Sevdalis. I'll leave her link down below. and. She does like fashion related videos and I was I started watching her because I really really want to be able to do fashion related videos for you guys Especially now that I have a vlogging camera. I have a proper way to be able to do it So I just looked up fashion videos and she was one of the people that came up and in one of her fashion videos She was talking about Platform running sneakers and I was like, what is that? And then she showed them and I was like, oh my god, I'm obsessed So I went onto the website literally right away It does not take a lot to convince me at all because I'm a visual person and if I see it I like it I want it and I buy it. So I ended up buying these right here, these are from the brand Superga, and these are so beyond ridiculously comfortable. They're like a canvas feel right here. You can tell they're like an off-white, nude-ish sort of color, so I bought these because I already have white sneakers that I wear all the time, so I was like, let me buy something a little bit different, and I really like the way the color of the, um, like, espadrille part went with the tan. So I ended up picking these up, and I am in love with them so much that I ended up buying them in another color, but I'm gonna show you guys how these look right now. Okay, so first pair of shoes that I have to show you guys, I should open my blinds, right? Give me some light in here. First pair of shoes that I have to show you guys are my Supergas. These are the tan ones. If you follow me on Instagram, you have seen these before because I've worn them a few times already. Um, they're just super cute. They look really good with shorts, dresses, skirts. These are a pair of crop trousers I have that are coming to Brennan and Cora. I'm pretty sure these will be launching You'll see this video before these launch. These are just a pair of mom jeans and a t-shirt that I have paired with them. I've worn them with everything. I've worn them with shorts. I've worn them with dresses. And I just think that they are so cute. Um, these are the tan color. I'm not sure if you're able to see the actual color of them in the mirror. But love them, love them, love them. Now, when I got them, I was like, wow, I love these so much. And I was like, well, now I need them in white. So I bought them in white too. They came in a couple of weeks ago. I was just saving them because I was like, I'm gonna take these to, wow, there's a stain on them. I have to try to get that out. 
I was like, I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna take these to Tulum with me. They're just perfect because they're a summer shoe, like 100% with the wicker bottom. They're just so bright and so pretty. So these are the exact same sneakers, but they are in the white color and you can actually get different colors for the little lace trimmings. And I actually ordered them with the gold, but they wrote me back or they contacted me and told me they were out of stock. So I just went and bought these instead. These I actually bought off of Amazon. So they're the same brand, they're Supergas, but they are from Amazon. And the style of the shoe is the Cotro Pew. 2730 Cotro Cotro Pew. I don't know. They're um, an Italian brand. Like the their catchphrase is "People's Shoes of Italy." So when I read that, I was like, okay, even more sold because I love Italy so much. So the reason that I ended up actually getting another pair was because the pair that I bought, I was nervous to get my true size because I obviously was gonna wear socks with them. So every time I'm wearing a shoe that requires a sock, don't mind my cats. Um, I always like to go half a size up so that I have room for the sock and I don't feel like I can't move my toes So I ended up getting a uh, A size 8 in my uh, Tan ones and they actually run big so I would recommend sticking to your true size They run big because I'm normally a size seven and a half So not that they run big and I need to go down like to a seven They just run to where you I wouldn't recommend you sizing up if you have to put a sock on So I would say just stick to your regular size and for me. I never ever 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 wear sneakers in a size uh, seven and a half because they always feel too tight when I put my sock on so yeah I ended up getting the white ones and they are just so cute. They are I haven't worn them Like you can see the laces aren't even done because I'm taking them with me to Mexico I'm probably gonna end up wearing them tomorrow for the plane with like shorts and a t-shirt or something I'm not sure but so I just quickly wanted to show you guys the difference between the white and the cream color um, these I got in a size seven and a half these I got in a size 8. I highly recommend to stick to your true size in these. But I just wanted to show you guys the difference in color. Where these are like white white. These are more of like a cream color. I haven't worn them yet which is why the laces aren't done up. But I love both so much for two completely different outfits. I like how these look with like black or darker colors. And I like how, excuse me, how these look with whites. Obviously brighter colors, lighter colors, pastels and all that. So I just wanted to show you the two of them side by side. So you can kind of see... The difference between them and then there's bear next I want to talk about some shoes that I got from nasty gal and I am NOT a nasty gal shopper I never have been there's nothing I have nothing against them I think I have like a t-shirt from them that I bought a couple of years ago But other than that, it's not a site that I normally go on I don't ever think to shop on there, but I went on there just looking and I ended up finding some shoes and with boots, um, I bought two pairs of boots and with boots, I completely forgot that I even had them because I bought them literally so long ago. With boots, um, I haven't found the right pair of boots that I want to splurge on and you guys know I am very okay with splurging on a pair of shoes. If I know that they're going to last me a long time, if I know that they're going to fit amazing and if I know that I'm going to wear them a lot. So I didn't want to spend a lot of money on boots. I've never spent a lot of money on boots just because I don't know exactly what style I would feel right spending the amount of money on. So I always buy pretty inexpensive boots. I think my most expensive boots are like a hundred bucks, nothing super expensive. So I ended up buying these boots right here and oh my God, everything about this boot, the front, the point, the little like platform here, the heel, like the shape and the wear and the look of these boots is just beautiful. And I don't have a nude colored boot. And that was something that I really, really wanted. Pointy toe shoes are my favorite. Like they are always a classic. They will be forever. But I just love these so much. And these I bought in a, it's a six, but I'm pretty sure that's the European size. Yeah, I bought these in a UK 6 US 8, which like I said, that's normally what I would wear a close toe shoe in and they fit perfectly. I love them and I will leave them linked down below if I can find them for you guys. Okay, so next in these shoes, we have the nude boots and I love them with this cropped type of jean because you can actually see the entire boot in them. They are so nice. I love them so much and I cannot believe how cheap I got them. I think they were like $30. Nasty Gal is always having like 80% off of their website, which is very odd to me, but I love them. They are so nice. The quality of them is so much more than what I like what I imagined. Like look at them. Especially on. They look so expensive, especially if you know how to style shoes like this. You can make them look so rich so expensive and i just love the way that they look with 
jeans like this. Also from Nasty Gal is another pair of boots. I don't know what I was going through when I started ordering boots because it is clearly June. And I live in Orlando, Florida, which is the hottest state in all of the world. I don't care where you live, do not argue with me. It has been 100, 101 degrees, disgusting, humid, atrocious. It's been awful, but I went on like a boot buying kick. I don't know what it was, but I love boots. Like I have so many pairs of boots now. I never really own that many. I owned like a pair of black and that was it. And now I can't stop buying them. So I ended up buying these like chocolatey brown. Oh, I haven't, mind you, I haven't worn these. I have had them for months already. Probably like two, a month, a month and a half, two months. And I've, I haven't taken them out of the box. I haven't worn them, nothing. They're so fly. Oh my God, I love these with a pair of like light wash denim, black leggings, black leather leggings. They are just so hot and I love the lace up. I don't have any boots like this at all. Pointed toe, of course. And they're like a croc embossed, which is, oh, divine. Just beautiful. So I am really excited about these. I got these also in a size us or uk6 um and the reference to them is chocolate so to me they're like a chocolatey brown slash burgundy color so here are the other boots it's hard to see the detail with the, there we go you can kind of see them there i don't think i'd specifically wear them with these shoes or these jeans um i like the other ones a little bit more because of the detail of the boot but the boots are so cute the color is amazing and they just look super badass like i feel like with a really cool leather jacket. I just, I love these so much. And they're all really comfortable. The heel height is perfect for a booty. And yeah, hopefully you guys can see them because of the lighting. I am obsessed. And then the last pair of shoes that I have to show you guys are a pair of slides. And if you guys don't follow me on Instagram or don't see me like post outfits or anything, I wear my slides from Zara almost every day. Um, I have this pair here that you can see the wear on these i've had these for like four three years about three years now almost four years and i wear them to death i also have them in a snake print and i saw these on nasty gal and they look so similar but in like a blushy nude and i was like oh this is perfect and i don't if i don't want to wear animal print or if i don't want to wear dark excuse me darker brown the one thing i will say though these are more comfortable than those those are made better i can tell the quality of the shoe but these kind of have like this is like cushioned it's very very comfortable i got these in a size eight as well us six again when it comes to something like this i don't like my feet being like right at the very end i feel like that looks super tacky if your shoes are like right at the end of your foot but i love them i have gotten so much wear out of them already like i wear these a lot these are the only ones out of those shoes that i have worn and i absolutely love them. If they still have them i will link them down below as well now my last shoes are the slides here and i mean they're pretty standard but i still wanted to show them to you guys they're like a beautiful nudie blush color they're super cute please don't mind all my boxes i have all my stuff oh my god right there but i love them they're very comfortable really easy to wear and just really easy to throw on and it makes you look like you tried something that's why i love slides so much now my last shoe is a shoe that i have been wanting for such a long time and I kept putting it off. I kept putting it off because I was like, girl, you don't need those, you don't need those, you don't need those. Well, clearly I do. These are a brand of Castanier wedges. They're from Spain. And these are a pair of espadrilles. And let me just say right now, I don't do wedges. I don't like wedges. I actually hate them. I think they're the ugliest shoe ever. No offense if you wear them. If you wear them and you think they're comfortable, it's because they are. They are so comfortable. I just do not like the look of wedges. The only type of wedge that I like is an espadrille and for the summertime. So I bought these and this basically ties around your ankles and you make a little like bow on the back and I am in love with them. I've worn them once uh, for my sister's like little wedding. Um, I wore these because I was wearing a little play suit and I figured these would be really, really cute to tie up the leg. And I bought these specifically for Tulum for like if we go out to dinner or if we do anything like super cute and fun. They're extremely comfortable. Like so, so, so comfortable. I got them on, I got them out of, off of net porte That's where I got them. So yeah, I love them. I got my size, I got my shoe in a size 38, which is a size us 8 and i absolutely love them so i will leave them linked down below for you guys as well i definitely would not wear them with these pants i like them a lot more with um dresses and shorts and stuff like that 
but this is what they look like on they're adorable and they literally just remind me of Italy or Spain or anywhere in Europe or anywhere tropical so excuse me I cannot wait to wear these these are like a nude color they come off very white on camera but they're like a true like linen-y like beige sort of color and extremely extremely comfortable while wow, this outfit I look like I'm going to like 18 different parties but they're super cute I love them love them love them they were definitely worth the money I hope you guys enjoyed this excessive shoe haul everything like I said I will leave down below for you guys I love all of these um, obviously I haven't been able to wear the boots yet but trust me come fall time you will see me rocking those boots all the time like I said everything will be linked down below and I will see you guys in the next video bye